Well, I don't think any building can be self-contained flat out. Even if you build, or maybe especially if you build on an open site in a, in a rural setting, then you really have to engage with the landscape. And I think more and more architects are coming to realize how fundamental the landscape quotient is in the overall conception of what architecture is. Landscape architecture and landscape and architecture or building architecture are two things that need to be seen in some sort of intimate relationship. In city settings, of course, where there are existing buildings before, and even though the buildings may not always be there, they may evolve and change to other buildings, I think it's very important that you um, uh, design a building that is accommodative of the other buildings around. And lastly, this is probably too long an answer, but most importantly, that how the building uh, confronts or addresses the public realm in, in a city like New York, the street. Is it friendly and welcoming and open? And that can be done in many ways, but it's very important that, that, that buildings not draw back and create veils or walls of closure. Mm -hmm.